This video is brought to you by New World Eternum Awaits by Amazon Game Studios that is going to be released on Spring 2021. It's an action massively multiplayer online role playing video game and guys if you will watch this trailer then you are going to love it because it seems to be a really really amazing game with its outstanding graphics. You can also pre-order it, link will be given below in the description of this video. What is going on guys this is Asim Arif and in today's video I am gonna show you how to bypass two factor authentication on Facebook. Like if you have lost access to your phone number or the google authenticator key that you used to receive the login codes then you don't have to worry about that because in today's video I will share with you a method by which you can get access to your account back without the login code. And guys I will show you the live proof in this video so watch this video till end like this video because it really appreciates me to make more videos for you and share this video with your friends so that if they face this problem in future then they will be able to get rid of this and if this is first time you are watching this video then hit the subscribe button press the notification bell and select all to stay updated with all my new videos so without any further delay let's get started So guys initially you will need to download this browser you can find its link in the description of this video and then simply go to facebook.com and log in your account here guys please note the email address it is namanshibir218 at the rate gmail.com because you are going to see the live proof in this video so you will need to remember this email address and guys now you can see here that it is asking me the login code to continue. But as I have lost access to my Google Authenticator key, so I am unable to receive the login codes. So in that case, I will tab on having trouble. Then select I don't have my phone and tab on continue. Then you will need to tab on contact us. And then you are going to see this form login approval code issues. Now scroll down and type here the full name that was mentioned in your account. Then here you will need to type the name of the mobile network like in Pakistan the mobile networks are Jazz, Zong, Ufon, Warid in India they will be uh, Geo, Vodafone etc and in other countries they will be different mobile networks so you just need to write the name of the mobile network here that you are using to receive the login codes but as I have turned on my two factor authentication via the Google Authenticator app so in my case I will write here Google Authenticator but if you have turned on your two-factor authentication via the phone number then you will need to type the name of the mobile network here okay I hope you understood now then you will need to select the issue from this given list there are different issues listed here like if you receive the code but it didn't work then select the first one if you don't have access to the phone at the moment but you still have this number then you can select the second one and so on as in my case as it turned on my two-factor authentication via the google authenticator app so i will select the lost option because there are no issues related to the google authenticator in this list so i will need to select the lost option then here you will need to type the description of the issue to get it just go to the description of this video and there you are going to find this description simply copy it from there like this the only thing you will need to replace is the first line here as I have written I have lost access to my Google Authenticator key you will write here I have lost access to my phone number if you have turned on your two-factor authentication via the phone number okay then simply paste it here and at the end I will write thanks then tab on choose file and here you will need to attach your government issued documents you can attach your government issued identity card driving license or passport but the name and the date of birth mentioned in your documents should match with your account okay now let me check first all the information is correct now scroll down and tab on send now just wait for a few seconds here so guys our document is successfully submitted to the facebook team now don't skip the video because I'm going to show you the live proof so now we will need to wait for an email from the Facebook team let me show you the time 
it is going on 5:20 pm and the date is 7th of august so i will be back when i will receive an email guys sorry for interference but i just wanted to tell you that i am more active on twitter nowadays so you can follow me here and can ask me your queries here is my username which is displayed on the screen so now let's get back to the video again so guys i am back after 12 minutes and i just received an email from the facebook team firstly i want to show you the email address you can see here it is the same email address namanshib218 at the rate gmail.com and i just received an email you can see the time two minutes ago thanks for confirming your identity please click the link below to finish the account recovery process so i will tap on this link and then save the browser and tap on continue now tap on yes and our account is unlocked now simply tap on go to settings and boom now we have entered into the settings of the account now you can turn off the two factor authentication if you want by tapping on this option then select turn off then select turn off again and now the two factor authentication is turned off on your account and now you will never be asked any type of login code to log into your account so guys this was all about today's video i hope that you enjoyed the video if you did smash the like button share the video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel catch you in the next video till that goodbye